thank you for joining us at reInvent 2023. My name is Jay Clifford and I'm a developer advocate for Influx Data. What I wanted to do was give you a bit of a 101 in what open telemetry is and what it means with InfluxDB 3.0. So, little history lesson first. Before the advent of microservices, we had monolithic programs. They might have been unwieldy to handle, but they were really easy to log and to understand what's going on in terms of your system. When we developed microservices, we have a chain of actions that happen across a series of services. It could be requesting something from a database. It could be loading up a website. It could be performing a transaction. And an example that we have here is this website here. Imagine we had a website that was selling telescopes. If I clicked through on a telescope, I went go shopping and I clicked here and I clicked add to cart and I said place order. What you don't realize behind the scenes is a series of microservices are all talking to one another in order to complete this transaction. The major issue right now is how do we monitor these transactions? How do we find out what's exactly going wrong if these microservices fail? The best way to do this is through traces, logs, and metrics. The problem with traces and logs and metrics, before open telemetry, there was no way of unifying them under one standard and one space. Open telemetry allows us to unify a standard of keeping metrics, logs, and traces agnostically for all vendors. This means we can actually use OpenTelemetry to monitor our full service stack. So what I'm doing here is I have Grafana up that's connected to InfluxDB 3.0. What we can see on our screen here is a series of services. So you can see we have our shipping service, our recommendation service, our payment service for which we're, for which we're interested in. What I can do is I can see the duration in metrics. It shows me how long the services are performing for. I can also start to drill into traces, which gives me an idea of the health of my system over a specific transaction. So you can see here, I'm on the recommendation service. I have a series of trace IDs. And if I want to drill into a trace ID, I can start looking into the spans that make up these. So if I check, uh, drop down here. I can look at the events that are occurring, the series of warnings that occur. The cool thing here is a lot of the time with vendors, they'll store traces in one database, they'll store logs in another, and they'll store metrics in a different database. With InfluxDB 3.0, you can store all of them in one time series database and use one single storage solution for all of your traces, logs, and metrics. So I hope this gives you a 101 on what OpenTelemetry is, what it could mean for you with InfluxDB 3.0. If you'd like to find out more information, check out our GitHub community. We have a great project there, including this demo, so you can try it out yourself. I hope you have a great reInvent or wherever you are currently, and we cannot wait to see what you do with InfluxDB 3.0.